Alright, so for this animation, there are two parts and this is part one. So you're gonna be learning step by step how to make this girl walking. Are you ready? Alright, let's go. Okay, so we're gonna go kind of fast a little bit in this video. So first we're gonna make a girl. Um, first thing first is the head of the girl, so you need like a circle shape. And then only uh, that, it's gonna be the body of the girl, which is a triangle shape. And um, you can just make it like as big as you want, as small as you want. And then another ellipsoid shape, um, this is gonna be the leg of the girl. And then you need two, so you make sure they control and then control D on your uh, keyboard to kind of duplicate this ellipsoid. Um, so you have like a same size and then you want to kind of rotate the uh, the shape a little bit so it looks like a crossing leg here but what I'm lo what we're looking at is the side of the girl like it's in a side view and you want to click on the body and make sure that you bring that to front and then the head you bring that to front so then the legs gonna be like the very back of this picture and then you kind of want to adjust this to be like crossing a little bit more another ellipsoid is gonna be the arm of the girl and um, you kind of want to adjust this to be in the middle or not the middle that's up to you but if you want um, you can just you know move the ellipsoid around you can go to a range and then you know you click on the line something like that but you want to have to click on the triangle first and then another that um, you click on the arrange on to center uh, this piece and I'm just gonna make this a little bit bigger as well you don't have to but that's up to you and it's gonna make the head a little bit lower then after that this is gonna change the color here um, it's gonna be a skin color so I just you know that's up to you I want it to be kind of like a light color um, but that's up to you as well like I said and the shape outline you can also select no shape outline as well but um, in this video I think with black it's gonna make it um, clearer for you to see the motion movement and you want to just, just click on this more like a rectangle shape but with like a curvy on the side so this is gonna be our hair this is a very easy way to make a, a, to to make a hair for your uh, animation but um, it's not gonna be like super real and you change it I use the um, black and this picture as well um, now we're gonna make the hat so you need the ellipsoid kind of of a shape and then this one looks like a dome shape but with like a flat surface on the bottom and you change the color of this and um, you can make any color as well you click on one control on your spacebar and another one and then you right click select uh, select group and then you group um, both of the shapes together now you just have to adjust the position the size the shape a little bit the angle of the hat the angle of the hair um, it can be anything um, you can make it longer make it bigger um, you can even change the color of the hat that's fine too or the hair like I said can make it blonde or brown um, this is up to you okay so you want to control and then select everything together you that bring that to front and make sure oh, sorry you group that and then you want to send everything to back especially two legs um, you want to send these two legs to the back so when you got this we add the animation click on one leg add effect uh, go to emphasis and spin then you want to click on the amount custom the spin into 60 degrees let's see no um, and set counterclockwise and then you want I think change to 50 degrees and then the speed is gonna be fast and um, you can make it slow as well um, that's up to you and you want another leg to be the same as the first one but the, it's gonna be like the same degree um, with previous of course and um, the speed is gonna be the same speed it's fast it's gonna be fast so this one is gonna be clockwise and then the timing you go timing make sure that so I think I'm just gonna repeat maybe like three times and not only that um, you want to make sure that you set auto reverse as well so it looks kind of a natural a little bit um, and let's see okay so it looks like the girl is walking just a little bit um, so I'm just gonna adjust the, the uh, okay so this is not quite 
normal so she looks like a robot a little bit so i'm gonna go with maybe change into like a 55 degrees i see let's see so you can actually change the degree around and then see if you like it or not you think it's like mm, a little bit like too slow too big uh, uh sorry too fast or she's walking like a step is too wide too long you can just change it that's up to you okay like I'm doing here, I'm just gonna like move uh, the position, I'll angle the leg um, a little bit. And um, if this is okay, I think this is okay now. So uh, I'm gonna, like I said, group everything together already for the motion path. Um, you go with the previous and make sure that you go to the right and everything is previous and now you can change this um, Go to very slow speed um, Super very very slow speed Okay, and um, Let me change the timing a little bit for this uh, spin. I want it to be like a smooth Maybe both smooth start and smooth end. let's check. Let's see that. Okay with smooth start and smooth end Okay, that's more natural. All right, so let's see. So now you've got the girl walking um, to the right side. Let me just move the girl um, to the left a little bit so she's walking toward the, this one, okay? All right, so now you get the girl walking. In order to add more stops into the scene, check out the part two video and I'll be waiting for you there. All right, see ya. Well, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.